Hello YouTube and welcome back to another quick look at another classic uh, video game, this time Black on the original Xbox. Now I'm playing this on the uh, Xbox 360 because it's actually a game that's backwards compatible for a change. And uh, as you can see it looks pretty superb as well, playing in widescreen. Now I bought this game yesterday for Cash Converts $1.99. Uh, if you don't own this game already I suggest you get down there and uh, pick yourself up a coffee because uh, I can imagine it's a nationwide price and it's totally worth your while. Now, uh, this is one of the uh, later releases on the original Xbox, I believe in 2006. But uh, as you can see, it shows the potential the original Xbox had, and uh, it also shows how very little game design has actually moved on in the past five years. I think it's pretty clear to see the direct influence this game has had on many of some of the most popular 360 titles of the past five years, including Call of Duty Modern Warfare, Rainbow Six Vegas, and countless other titles. The guns feel really satisfying to use in this game, and the particle effects and the way things explode. I've not really seen them better, to be honest, even since the release of the 360. And the basic premise of the game is it's a bit of a flashback story, basically. These are events that have already happened and uh, you play through them as you tell the story. Uh, basically, from what I can gather, I mean, this is probably this is the second time I've played this game. What I can gather from the story is you're actually uh, being uh, interviewed by a government official who's basically told you that if you don't tell him exactly what went wrong and what happened, uh, then he's going to release information to the public and you'll go to jail for the rest of your life. So uh, you decide to tell the story, and that's is uh, when we start playing it through. So. It took me five years to discover this game because uh, I can imagine in 2005 this was absolutely mind blowing. I, should, I would think if I was to tell any of my friends that this was on the 360, they would totally believe me. That's how little really I believe games have changed. objectives as you play through the game, picking up intel and uh, a lot of other things like that. I'm not quite sure how I do it because it's just kind of picking up random boxes as you move around. I don't think the game actually has a run button, it has got crouch, it has got zoom, but I'm not sure if it's got run. I could be mistaken. No, it doesn't seem to. Some really fantastic set pieces in the game, and uh, we're just about to see one now. Just went nicely, probably. That's the wrong button. And so yeah, this is the way you get rid of windows. You get rid of the, uh, really 
back there, and there's a great one there. Yeah, totally brought the house down. this room here the level will end. So uh, this has been Black on the uh, original Xbox and uh, I totally recommend picking it up. Seems like an absolutely quality game and uh, I look forward to uh, playing it through to completion. So I'll thank you for watching, hopefully I'll upload some more videos soon.